Hello my friends, are you ready to get absolutely inspired for the current week challenge? Which is called Camp Dreamlight, by the way, amazing name for the challenge. 10 out of 10 uh, game loft. So, in this video we're gonna go through the most different and incredible submissions that our community have submitted. Uh, they're already done, some people already finished their dream stamp submission on basically first two days. Congratulations, you guys are awesome. I just finished my submission yesterday as well, and uh, I did it during the live stream, and it took over three hours. It was one of the longest streams I've ever had, and basically, okay, let me let me tell you one very helpful tip that's probably going to help you a lot. So this is my submission that we did during the live stream, and the idea was why it took so long is because I wanted two characters to sit one in the chair and one on uh, the Dreamlight tree. But as you know, there's a glitch in Distant Dreamlight Valley when the character just sits down and then gets up immediately. So during the live stream, we discovered why this happens and how to fix this. And that was super helpful. Without that knowledge, I would not be able to get the final photo of a dream step. So basically, the, the way you fix it, if you have the character sitting down and then immediately standing up, what you need to do is to go to uh, furniture mode remove the chair just click on the chair that you want the character to sit on and just delete it from the map and then find it again in the furniture inventory and put it back just by basically deleting and putting a new chair down it fixes the issue for one sit down so the next time your character sits on the chair they're gonna sit for about 15 20 seconds and then if you manage to get a perfect shot, great. If you still want another try, after they get up, basically next time they sit down, it's also going to be very quick. So basically every time you have to reset your chair, just delete it and put it back from the furniture mode. It absolutely blew my mind that that there's that's actually a glitch that, that can be so easily solved. Basically, I, I just had to reset my chair in between the shots. Dreamlight Tree, unfortunately, you cannot reset, so in that case, I just had to wait for... Basically, I had to wait for one character sit on the chair that was reset, and then within 15 seconds for somebody else to just briefly sit on the Dreamlight Tree. And I finally managed to get a snap, and I'm so happy. Thank you so much, guys, for sticking with me for a four-hour stream yesterday. It was insane. Anyway, let's get into some inspiring uh, dream snaps. Let's start with Ain Slay with a Starry Starry Night Camp Dreamlight. Oh my god, that is so good! I initially wanted to go for the Starry Night, uh, but in the end I decided to go for a sunset. And my god, this is so beautiful. I, I love the constellation, I love the Dreamlight tree sparkles. Incredible work. And no problems, no characters to mess up your shot. Why do I keep using villagers in my shot? It's not worth it! They're terrible! <laughs> well done. Cleophie Rose, my god! I really enjoyed creating the scenery and I was lucky Turtle invited herself to the picture. What? It's a beach camp! That looks so good! Wait, you have a forest on the beach? That just blew my mind to bits. I have never, ever seen pine trees and like a whole forest going on on the beach. I'm curious, did you make this just for the dream snap or is it actually how your beach looks like? I'm not gonna lie. It looks absolutely unbelievable. You literally have forest on the beach, and then on the little island, you have Minnie's house with forest around it. I just can't get over it. This is the most unique thing I've ever seen in Disney Dreamlight Valley. It shouldn't make any sense, but god damn, it looks incredible. I'm... If I ever reset my valley, I'm making a beach forest. <laughs> that is awesome. Here's another beach camp from, uh, from Kitty. All right, that is great. That I, I, I haven't even considered doing beach, uh, a, a beach camp. That looks good. That looks good. Definitely a very unique look. I hope it's not gonna backfire because I feel like 
Beach is not exactly the first thing that comes to mind when it comes to camping, even though it should. Like, it, it's, I, I bet it's fun camping on the beach. Uh, so I hope people are not gonna associate beach just with RV and the forest, which, uh, the ones that were used on the banner, pretty much. But I, I love your glass figurines. Look at that. Disney glass figurines. That is so cool. I love it. Well done. We got Tracy. And now the dark shot. We have a telescope. A lot of people told me to use telescope, but in the end, I decided not to go for the dark night. And I went for sunset. So telescope and sunset doesn't make sense. If you look at the sun, sunset with the telescope, you're going to get your eyes burned down. But in the night shot, telescope makes a lot of sense. And uh, I love the foregrounds. The, the painting table just looks incredible. It's a very beautiful shot. Thank you for the inspiration. Pandemic Misfit went for the winter camp. Oh, oh, wow, we have forest camps, beach camps, winter camps. Let's see what other kinds of camps we're going to find today. This is incredible. And a poor and... I have never used this igloo thingy in Distant Dreamlight Valley, and god damn it, I want to use it in one of the dream snaps. I'm gonna find, uh, hope, I mean, Christmas coming, probably gonna be a bunch of winter-related dream snaps, and I'm, I, I want to use this house. It looks so beautiful. I can't quit you by Column RN. I'm still messing with it, but it's what I have so far. Oh, that is great stuff. Eric, little bromance going on i also went for the male avatar in my submission i don't know people said i only had male characters basically camping together so i decided well it's going to be a bro gathering you know like a, a little bro camp and it turned out great now i regret not inviting eric to be honest pixie returning player new to dream snaps was super excited to return from hiatus and discover this excellent feature wow that must be a one hell of a discovery after you get uh, after you get into it, you won't be able to quit. Getting moonstones and just unleashing your creativity in these beautiful shots, it's extremely addictive. So if I was a betting man, I would say welcome back. You are never you're not going on another hiatus. Hiatus? Hiatus. 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 I don't it's a complicated word. Uh, basically, you're not leaving anytime soon. By the way, beautiful shot. Night shots work really well with this Dream Snap. I feel like this is one of the ones where, uh, well, a part of all the spooky nightmare ones, I feel like night camping actually makes sense and could look really beautiful. So I'm looking forward to seeing all the dark shots. But it shouldn't be too dark. And this one is not too dark. As, well, as long as you can see what's going on, it's perfect. And this one, like, it has just enough lights to see exactly what's happening. Beautiful shot. We have a nice little sunrise from Anita. Raccoon and I having breakfast as we watch the sunrise. Oh, yes. Man, that looks good. I like what's going on here. It's like, it looks like a vast field in front of you. Wow. Okay, this one... I'm gonna be honest, I think it's my favorite so far. It's absolutely gorgeous. Even though all of them are, like... Our community gets lots of 4,000 Moonstones rewards, so I'm sure all of these are, like, gonna, gonna do extremely well. But this one, I don't know, hits something special. It's just, it just has this something that gives me, like, this nice feeling inside. Like, it just connects to me. I don't know, I, I don't know why. It's, it's, it's gorgeous. Like, if I were, if I were to go camping, this, this would be the one. Debbie Five Foot. Ooh, we have another, uh, winter one. First time posting here. Can, uh, already had this area set up. Just had to evict Anna and Kristoff and move in Buzz. Let's go. First post. Welcome, Debbie. Welcome to our community. And welcome to sharing your Dream Snap submissions. That is always very fun and very helpful. And oh my goodness. Which, which house is that on the background? Wait, is that is that the the new fro frozen house that we got? I I love this. It's like little village of snowmen. Wow, that that is that is such a creative idea. That is very creative idea. I love how this house looks on the back. My main problem with this house was that it's it's really hard to get it in the shot 
but in like when it's far away like this on the background it actually looks incredible i'm definitely using this house in some of my winter submissions thank you for thank you for inspiration the lion is den so my raccoon and i were exploring and found this spot Ooh, camping in uh sunken not sunken what <laughs> sun the plateau that is good. That is so such a unique landscape. It's like a camping in a savanna. Honestly, one thing this picture is missing is a bunch of lions. Lion trying to steal your food from your camping site. It's almost like bears, but like lions or bears of the savanna. That that would, that would look so cool. Well done. Sprite camping with my favorite ducks. Oh, Scrooge went camping! No, I want to... Oh, I feel bad. You took Scrooge out for, for some rest and I didn't. I decided not to go with him because... I honestly don't know why. I feel like I probably should have. And you got him to sit down. This looks good. This looks like a bunch of people just having a good time. Love the foreground, love the background, the sunset is gorgeous, the colors, everything. This this photo is 4,000 moonstones, if I were to guess. Danny Kuhn. The aliens are watching. I hope they're not hungry. There's not enough food for everyone. Wow. What an interesting outfit for camping. <laughs> A bunch of aliens, too. <laughs> Ooh, the colors look very interesting. The, uh, the filter here works really well. I, I also use this filter. No, wait. I think I used a different filter. But these these kinds of filters work really well with Sunset. Well done. Venice! Camping in a fairy forest. Had to destroy half of my glade. And all of the things we do for our dream snaps. Yep, that's... That's... Oh! 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 Oh, oh my god! No way! This one takes the cake for me. This one... Wow. Now this is how you do camping. We have almost every biome. I wonder if anybody did camping in Forgotten Lands. Which which biomes are we missing so far? I haven't seen any uh, plaza. Which plaza is like a central, like, the, the, the camping need, needs to be far away. So we saw pretty much all the biomes except Forgotten Lands and Plaza. This looks amazing! Little fairy tale forest. Oh, that makes me want to build in my Glade of Trust so much. Well done. This is, wow, blew my mind. This is going on a thumbnail. Stargazing in the mountains. Enjoy a wholesome night in the nature with my friends Olaf and Kristoff. Kirch Becker, I think. Oh my goodness. I also have Olaf and Kristoff in my shot. I have a lot of people in my shot. Never again. This is gorgeous. Look at those mountains on the back. I didn't even think of that. People do camp around mountains. This does look like it's like you're actually in the mountains. This is incredible. Very well done. And the moon. Chef's kiss. Princess. A little camping trip with Fox and Stitch. Nothing wrong with that. Looking good. Wow, actually the bridge like this looks really, really good. I love this part of the forest. It's very different. It looks like usually I haven't seen many dream snaps from this angle in the forest, and it's it looks incredible. We have Schneen. Not me being disappointed after last results, temporarily deciding not to put effort in again, but then hyping myself up by thinking at least I got creative. Snaps is about the fun, I reminded myself. That is absolutely true. If I if I just wanted moonstones, I wouldn't spend four hours today. On trying to get the perfect shot it's it's about like achievement and that feeling of satisfaction of getting the absolute perfect shot that you wanted that that's that's definitely true 
So me being the campfire holding a huge s'more, I'm glad I got over my mood because I had so much fun creating this. I'm glad as well. Let's take a look. Oh my god, your head is on fire. <laughs> Wait! Where is this little pots or cauldron thing he came from? I've never... What is this item? I'm pretty sure you cannot put items on top of the barrel. I have never seen this item before. It's it's like a cauldron on top of the barrel. Is I I have never seen this item before. That just blew my mind. Somebody got to tell me where it's from. Is it Scrooge or is it Premium Shop? By the way, the shot is gorgeous. Those tents so good for camping. I kind of forgot we have tents. I've seen so many people in the comments saying, I wish we had tents. And we do actually have tents. Oh my god, I forgot about them completely. Wow, this shot looks incredible. Well done. Foxy, my god. This is, You went for the... Like those uh, campgrounds where you can come with your own tent. And they have like some facilities in there. Uh, a pool, some parking. Wow, that is so unique. I've never, I haven't seen anybody do something like this. Like a whole campgrounds, not just little tiny ca camping spot. That is awesome. Well done. Lily Tozy wanted to go with the Bob Ross vibe in nature. Unfortunately, I do not have an afro. <laughs> However, we did not make mistakes. We don't make mistakes, only happy accidents. Now, how about we put a happy little Mickey Cloud over here? Oh. Yeah, I mean, come on. You, you, you get the Bob Ross right away, even though the hairstyle is not exactly the same. It's like, it's like, it's really obvious. And that Mickey Cloud is absolutely gorgeous. Wow. Very unique submission. Love it. Well done. That's a boat. <laughs> what? Interesting choice. Pippi me. Pippi me. From from my observations, likes to add lots and lots of lights in 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 her dream snaps, and this is not exception. Wow. I'm gonna be honest. This definitely draws attention immediately. A lot of things are going on in the shot. I love the idea of putting the campgrounds, like, having a little border around it. It's... I should have done that. That makes sense. Incredible shot as usual. Well done. Yum yum shrimp! <laughs> Going on a romantic trip with our man, Eric. I mean, doesn't seem that romantic. He's sitting so far away from you. Get closer to him! That is awesome. That is a really good shot. I love all the flowers and, and sparkles. Fantastic job. No one said anything about mountain lions on the camping trip. What? Nala hunting Christoph. That looks so spooky. It looks like she's hunting you. And I love the light on the face of the character. Look at that. Wow. The lighting in this photo is immaculate. This is so freaking good! I don't see Christoph in the shot. I'm sure he's somewhere, but... he He's doing a good job evading the lion. Wow! It actually looks like she's hiding in a bush and trying to attack. That squirrel, probably. That looks like this gives me like this looks really spooky. I can't believe this is Dreamlight Valley. It looks like real nature. That is definitely the most unique shot of this week. This is incredible. Wow, it this blows me away. Lena, Camp Dreamlight with a beast. Ooh, this looks very shiny. You can see the RV lights. It's definitely a unique shot. A little bit too dark for my liking, but it is not an outfit challenge. It's not an outfit challenge, it's a furniture challenge, so I think it's okay. Well done. Coco, let's go glamping. Oh my god, that is great. Very beautiful composition. 
lots of lots of items here. Lots of items. Well done. Steph Greywolf. Winter camping with Olaf. I don't know, I like winter camping. Olaf is sitting on the log in front of the little uh, fire. That is awesome. I, I went for the same vibe, but unfortunately Olaf didn't sit down for me. Like, basically I had three characters and I, was, I, I said, whoever sits down, whoever two sit down at the same time, you guys are getting in a final shot. I did not have patience to get another shot like this. Well done. That is awesome. All right, guys. I think it's enough inspiration. We, I tried to uh, to oh, show the, like the, the wide variety of different ideas. There was a lot of very similar shots, but very like differently executed. I I was blown away by so many submissions. How you managed to do a unique take on camping and make it absolutely breathtaking. Well done. I hope this was helpful. I hope this was inspiring. Thank you so much, everybody, for uh, sharing your submissions. So everybody who, for some reason, does not feel inspired for this challenge can get some potential inspiration, some cool ideas from your submissions. And uh, thank you so much for spending four hours yesterday on the live stream and uh, keeping me company while I was completely descending into absolute insanity while trying to get two characters to sit down at the same time. Never again. I learned my lesson. I, I'm not going to ever try to get two characters to sit down. Unless I, I would, I, it would really elevate my shot. We'll see how it goes. Thank you for watching. Good luck with your dream snap. And goodbye. Goodbye.